Hey you two, happy Friday. Today I have an uh, unboxing for you guys to check it out. This is the 20 amp 12 volt slash 24 volt PWM. Uh, PWM stands for uh, pulse width modulation. Solar uh, panel controller. or a charge uh, regulator and this one has a LCD with a dual USB charging port so without further ado let's go ahead and do the unboxing <clears throat> it is, uh, I ordered this from uh, eBay and it came from a uh, ship from China. It says Tai Yang Nen Kong Zi Qi, the solar control panel. Okay? Let's see. And show the solar uh, panel. And this is the controller. It's an ISO certified. Back in 2008. So <clears throat> as you can see, this is a 12 volt slash 24 volt, 20 amp. This one with the 10 amp, 20 amp or 30 amp. And this also uh, another uh, model that you could charge uh, 48 volt and this one uh, shows a uh, USB shows a PWM over there <clears throat> so the it has a dual port uh, USB and is uh, has a five volt at the two amp. So this side is the English. It has an LCD uh, display. PWM battery charging, all necessary protection encrypted. Adjustable controller parameter of the system. And right here it shows a 5 volt 1 amp USB output. So I guess it's uh, 1 amp 1 amp, so total it has a uh, 2 amp. Uh, there's a Chinese, I mean, there's a English on the, the other side of the box. Let's go ahead and do the unboxing.
<clears throat> so they give you like a measurement. So you can decide where you want to mount mountain on your wall. And this one show you all the connections. The solar panel goes in here, positive, negative, and your battery, and then your uh, output or whatever you want to connect to uh, lights or uh, any. Uh, Any <clears throat> any device that you want to connect to. So there's the English part or Chinese in the back. So you can set the low output to be on 24 hours or low, low to be turned on after sunset and close after setting uh, hours. So I guess you can set the what time you want the lights to go on and what time you want the lights to go off. And this one is the TX1220. Uh, the 20 in the back stand for uh, 20 amp. There's a TX1210 uh, stand for 10 amp on the last two digit. And then a TX1230. Uh, the 30 stand for 30 amp. And the other two on the back right here, the TX. Uh, 4820, uh, 4820. Huh, that's weird. Because uh, the, the 20 on the back, it shows 10 amp on the 4820. And then the 4830, it shows uh, 20 amp for the 48 volt system right here. So you could charge the CO battery or gel battery or flood battery. And there's a voltage that you can set to so you don't overcharge the uh, your battery from the solar panel. So those are the default battery for the flow and uh, discharge what when to stop so it won't uh, drain down the battery all the way. And then you could discharge, reconnect at the 12.6 volt default and you get adjustable that's weird this one uh, says uh, USB output is 5 volt at 3 amp operating uh, temperature is a uh, minus 35 through 80 it's 80 or 60 uh, 80 degree uh, Celsius the size weight is uh, the dimension is 150 by 78 by 35 millimeter and it's 150 gram. Okay, let's go check out the system right here. So on the left right here it shows the LCD PWM. 
and solar control uh, solar charge controller five volt maximum is two amp and it shows a USB right here so for example if you work on the control panel you could uh, plug this in to charge your phone or uh, connect to a flashlight so I'm not sure if, if there's a backlight or not on this display and this is uh, the change the menu and stuff like that and go back and forth up and down to set it and then uh, positive and negative for the solar panel here positive and negative for the, the battery where you store the energy positive and negative output you can connect to lights or anything that is uh, used 12 volt or 24 volt so you unscrew this and then you insert the wire and you screw it down <coughs> screw it down to tie it up The casing is made out of plastic. And that is the spec right there. Oh, so the back over here, <clears throat> the back plate is made out of aluminum. So which is pretty nice. So I guess it's, it acts as a heat heat sink. <clears throat> so your uh, controller won't go uh, overheated. So uh, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for uh, new upcoming video and stuff like that or DIY tutorial and stuff. And uh, you can share this with your uh, friends, uh, family or social media if uh, any of them are trying to convert their uh, system to solar uh, panel. So it's free energy from the sun. So I'm trying to look into it and maybe do something uh, about it. Okay, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next uh, video. Peace. Happy Friday.